A superstar gets a certain feeling when he knows there's a strong possibility he may exit the match in a completely different condition than he entered. That's not exactly a comforting thought when it's your career. Well, in these head-to-head -head matchups, you've got no one to rely on but yourself. And that's the way it should be. Both these superstars are going to find out about themselves real quick. But here's the thing. You have to perform if you want to bask in that WWE glory. What are your thoughts on JBL? I think it's safe to say that he'll never suffer from a low self-esteem problem. He absolutely loves himself. Cole, I'll give you half my fortune if JBL loses this singles match here tonight. That's how confident I am. Yeah, and? <laughs> What's wrong with being a little extra confident in your abilities? I kind of respect that. Seth flying into the turnbuckle with a brutal Irish whip. Oh, man, that landing, that sudden stop, that has to hurt. The repetition on that move is becoming deliberate at this point. Plenty of fight left. You're right, still near 100%. This is trouble. Look at that strength. Watch it. And he powers out. The ring may not be big enough for what's about to unfold here. Are you kidding me? This entire arena may not be big enough. Perhaps feeling a little more comfortable on the outside at this point. Yeah, more comfortable outside the ring than inside. JBL with good timing here. JBL is indeed a success in all facets of his life. A self-made millionaire who also has the toughness to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody on the roster. And there's the axe handle. There's some loving axe handles. Yeah, one after another. Sometimes all it takes is a punch, or in this case, repeated punches. What a sequence of punches. The finality of this environment is so apparent, King. I don't know about that. But this area is so, so dangerous. Rich and tough? It's no wonder why so many guys can't stand JBL. Or maybe it's jealousy. Who knows? JBL reverses it. When this guy's on, look out. to the face. Well, we're on the move here. Will he tap out? Will he submit to the camel clutch here? He's trying to escape, but the more energy he expends, the closer he is to being out. Oh, and did you hear the impact? He's starting to show signs of fatigue. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. If it's me, I'm focusing my attention on winning the match inside the ring. All this time on the outside doesn't appear to be doing him any good. It's a good point, John. And I'd say this match is about as even as it can get at this point. Really pushing his opponent to the limit here. Right down the neck. It looks like we're going to see what kind of pain they can inflict out here on the floor. Just when he thinks he's going the one way, his opponent takes him another. He's begging for it. He's looking a little off balance. I'm not sure. We got a cover. And a kick out. Uh, the kick out's all that's saving. This match goes on. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. He was able to reverse that. JBL starting to fade a bit. 
This may very well be one of his toughest challenges in a very long time. But there is no quit this guy. Trust me, this one's far from over. He anticipated that move perfectly. Look at those eyes. Oh, yeah, this could be big. 